Okay, it's the Pink Fury's turn for 1v1s. And this little legendary hero is one of my favorites. So let's start smacking this big hammer down for the BK. And we do hit the BK just before he loses his super, but there's no chance of him coming back from there. But now for the Archer Queen, we've got a hop skip all the way to the top. While well, we're taking some chip damage, and we just take her out in one. The Archer Queen's just like, nope, mate. Come on, Pink Fury, right, Countess, this should be an interesting one. So the Countess going to flip behind us. We are going to hit her with the hammer, and we take her out in one. Okay, didn't see that one coming, so the Wave Master. Can we do the same? I think he's got more health, but let's see. Will we? He stuns us before we take our hit. Okay, there you go. No, we don't take him out in one, but we do. He does another super, stuns us for the second time. But um, is that enough to... There we go. Pink Fury, almost sweating there. Now for the Shield Maiden, this might take a little while, so I'll wipe the stats up right here. And it's just a matter of who gets the super first, and we get our super, but yes, we do it before she takes a bubble, which is critical. We're just going to chip away at ourselves. Hopefully the bubble comes away before we hit, which it does. We hit another one, and goodbye, the Shield Maiden. Now on to the SK, the most important foe who seems to win everything. So let's see if we can smack him down first of all and get him down to his first five, which we almost do first hit. He hits us back, has a free couple of cheeky hits, and we do get him down to his revive. Oh, but we used the super beforehand. That's not looking good for us. He supers and Battus is out. The undefeated Skeleton King. Now the Royal Champion is going to hit a hop skip at the top and I think it's going to be similar to the Archer Queen. We're going to whack him in one. See you later. Now for the Grand Warden. We're just going to hop skip up there while he'll be taking chip damage. He does get his shields off before we get a hammer but I think that's not a problem. Just we just take him and his shields out. Now for the Nature Warden. We are going to hit him up. He's going to do his super first, but we are going to batter him right down to like a third, well, nearly less than a quarter of his health. We have another super and two hammers, and the deer is down. Now, the monk, now this should be interesting if we manage to get our super before the monk hits ours. We should be able to take him out in one, but it's not looking likely. Oh, we don't take him out in one. Of course, he's got more than 40 HP. Oh, the monk destroys us. Now, the battle box. Sorry, the battle machine. And uh, he starts to boost the R, look at that, right down to the end of health. And we just another one to finish him off. And that's the Pink Fury, guys. She is awesome. She's my favourite. See you in the next one.